All right, let's talk to Eric here because uh, we saw those holiday decorations. It's feeling like the middle of December right now. Yeah, boy, this has been an abrupt change, Eric. This could be Mariah Carey on the radio by the time you get toward this weekend. People are going to be thinking about, yeah, that midwinter feel out there for sure. Temps this evening just dipping back close to 40 degrees, and we're going to kind of level out there. It's in the 30s for a time, but we're watching that Arctic front, and as it approaches, we'll get a little burst of southwesterly winds overnight, even a chance for a few rain showers, and then we bring in the cold. The core of that right now is diving down. Down across the Great Lakes. You can see that ocean effect. Or, hmm, ocean effect. The uh, lake effect snow really kicking in, although we could see some ocean effect shower activity this weekend on Cape Cod as that cold air pours over Mass Bay. So there you see the front. Some rain showers possible this evening, especially in the middle of the night and early tomorrow morning. The good news is where we expect snow squalls across northern New England, perhaps even into the Berkshires. It is in the middle of the night, and this whole front is offshore by early tomorrow morning, so they should not be around for the morning commute. Our story tomorrow is all about the wind and the cold. So tonight, again, holding about where we are for temperatures, a chance for some rain showers. Tomorrow morning, right around 6 to 7 a.m. is where that front is pushing offshore. So we start around 40 degrees, but quickly, even with plenty of sunshine tomorrow, temps will fall all day, and we're into the 20s by the time we head toward the evening. And not really just a temperature story, but the winds will be very gusty tomorrow, 20 to 45 miles per hour. Wind advisories are out. We could see a few trees coming down, but certainly it's going to make it feel a lot colder outside. Wind chill value in the teens and 20s in the morning. Then as we head into the afternoon, it's still teens and 20s. Tomorrow night is where we go back into the single digits and teens, and that's where we wake up on Saturday morning. So a very cold start to the weekend. Actual air temps, teens and 20s. Uh, temps that you would see in the middle of winter, not often in November. Cold enough to challenge some records. Record in Worcester is 14. And the record in Boston is 24. I think we'll be within a degree or two. The wind will calm down on Saturday and much quieter on Sunday. And if you haven't had a freeze yet across Cape Cod and the islands, well, this is going to be at the end of the growing season region wide. So there's your seven day outlook for Veterans Day observances on Saturday. Again, the wind calms, but highs will stay stuck in the 30s. We do get back into the mid 40s on Sunday and a chance for some flurries Monday, but overall, it is a very cool pattern even into next week.